Ladies and gentlemen, I am in Lake Oswego, Oregon, in um, in the supermarket called New Seasons. I'm walking around, just filming the place. It's an organic market right here. This is in the rich part of town. Right here. This is Lake Oswego. It's like rich people. It's fucking. Big guy creates some content today. See, I don't get this stuff because it's usually too expensive, you know? Or oh, it's not like getting it sliced, like right fresh, you know? Um, <coughs> like, you get all kinds of meats in there and stuff. Oh, so I don't really waste my time buying this kind of stuff usually, you know? Um, Unless something stands up. I've gotten this stuff before. I've made, uh, I've made like eggs with it and whatnot. And, like a vegetarian egg scramble, shit like that with the with the tofu and all that. But I've I've made stuff with that before. I don't buy that. That's that's a waste of time. It seems like. Uh, yeah, not really. Not for real. I don't, do is I don't buy overpriced Italian products that they sell. I try to get the most real thing possible for the, for the good money, you know. But you got like tomato sauce and the cases here and stuff like that. And it's kind of, you know, then we got the milks in here and stuff. And cashew milk. So, I mean, sometimes I... I drink stuff like that. Not a lot though, but and you have the nice produce department over here. So I'm walking you through the, uh, the overall layout. Hundred percent organic. Some of this stuff it costs money, depending on what you. Uh, you get baby spinach about now. Yeah, I guess that's not too bad. Um, Baby greens, three forty nine. But I just wanted to check it out. It's kind of between me going to another place, so I'm going to exit the store here, and I'm going to Flying Pie Pizzeria next. I'm going to get a slice over there. That place right over there. But this is a wealthy town. I mean, look, look at the plaza here. It's uh, Sport Clips, Little Big Burger, and all these places over here. Uh, it's like a complex, like an industrial sized complex over there. Uh, some people are sitting down right over here. Um, Then you got a water fountain over there. I was at that water fountain. That that's a nice feature right there. I think they have it a shopping mall, you know, like this have like a I can't even see the that. I wanna get a picture of a water fountain over here. I think there's a lot of bizarre. Families with kids are out here. It's not the singles paradise that they make it seem out here. It's really not. Jeez, uh, I can't see for shit. I gotta come over here. I can't fucking see in the camera. Much as I love the sun, I can't see what I'm trying to film. But that's the waterfall right there. Um, that we got down through. A lot of families with kids in the Portland area. There is. It's a surprising amount to consider. You think it's young people everywhere. You see Portland. But anyway, I'm coming back down this way. I might even go to Lake Oswego Center later, downtown Lake Oswego. But Flying Pie is one of the better pizzas in the area. 
Sea of the Northwest doesn't have great pizza. I think they're pretty good. At least from when I remember having them seven years ago. So, when I was here then. So, we'll see how that goes. And then, this is New Seasons again. It's a nice place, but to come here regularly, you know, you gotta drop a bit of money and stuff. But it's, it's okay. So, that being said, I'm gonna go to Fly and Pie right now. Ladies and gentlemen of the planet Earth, this is Flying Pie in Lake Oswego, uh, Oregon. We get a Widmer sign up there because Widmer Bear is big out here. It's like an Oregon bear. It's good stuff. I like the Hefeweizen. Widmer Hefeweizen. It's like one of my favorites. Um, then you get an arcade room in there. It looks like you get Pac-Man and all that shit. It's a cool place. I went to the one in Portland before. Um, never been to this one. Um, slice of sausage coming out for five dollars and it's pretty big I would say you can't get pizza that often so when you do it's kind of more uh, special especially when it's halfway decent you know so they get the, the hot pepper on the table right here and cheese and all that kind of shit um, so when it comes, I will be back to film it. But yeah, this is a nice location right here. I like it. But I'll be back in a little bit. They don't have them in the county where I live in, though. They have them in um, Clackamas County <coughs> in Mount Loma, but they don't have them in Washington County. All right, talk to you later. Here it is. Five dollar slice of pizza right here. Five dollar slice. It's pretty big. It's not small, I don't think. Don't want to get it on my nice new pants though. Hot. Very hot. It's got a cool one anyway. And they're playing Ozzy Osbourne. What are the chances? I don't care about the sunshine, yeah, cause mama. Mm. A lot of sauce in here, wow. Mm. Looks like there wasn't a lot of sauce in here. But it's underneath. Mm. It's almost like a Chicago style size. Almost is. It's thick. Slice of pizza, this thing is. I wish I could hold up the whole thing, but it might. See? That's it right there. Might even be bigger than a baby's arm. Right into the head, and you're gonna fuck the chance some skin off in the mouth. See what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. My opinion. 
flying pies, the best pizza in Portland that I've had. I mean, there's others like Escape from New York and shit. But, at least from all the ones that I've had, this is one of the better ones. Good music in here. best pizza in Portland, right here. I mean, the ones they say are good are just too hard to get to, you know, parking's a bitch and it's downtown or whatever. Like whatever New York style pizza they might have here. But seeing well, this place is easy to get to, and it's like a small chain in a couple of counties. I think it's real good pizza for the Northwest anyway. So, and a lot of them are not very good. This one is though, so with all that being said, I'm gonna go right now. I think I made a good sense of enough video on this uh, pizza. I'm gonna show you the sausage pizza. That's what I'll give a view right there after I ate some of it. So with that being said, I'm gonna go. Right. Oswego, Oregon. Right.
around a bit then I'll probably I don't know what I'm gonna do next but I'm gonna come out right now finish this coffee that I have brought it from the house where I'm at so I bring my own coffee I save money you know I, I do these things I bring whatever I have in the house kind of thing it's amazing I don't even have to I don't even have a sweatshirt on right now that's how good the weather is out here. Jesus. I'm surprised. It's sunny. It's warm. In Portland here, it's fucking warm. It's like it's switching all of a sudden. And it was fucking cold a couple days ago out here. Fucking cold out here a couple days ago. Look at this nice posh center right here. This is... You can afford this. You got it made. Oh, damn. Near Portland, it's a rich town. Some of the sports players live here in this place. Simply posh, and it's so funny how I would mention the word posh, and simply posh would be right there. That's 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 hilarious. Fucking fucking hilarious. Um, coming back down and around, Chucks. I guess In 600 feet, coffee. turn right onto North State Street. I thought I shut that fucking thing off. Come on. I thought I fucking shut that goddamn thing off. Jesus Christ. I don't need it. Nope. 
So, that place down there, that looks pretty good. Whatever that is. It's a nice neighborhood. It's a damn sure nice neighborhood. I'm proud of my Eagle Scouts. Who gives a fuck? Who gives a shit? Jesus Christ. These people who advertise their parents, bullshit, parental, they're so proud of their kids. They put it on their damn cars. Who gives a shit? Jesus Christ. Who gives a flyer? Fuck. Um, anyway. Right Aid Pharmacy. Take the next right onto North State Street. Shut up. Stupid ass fucking GPS won't shut up. Anyway. So. Right around here. Uh, some back parking areas here. There's a lot of parking over here. Holy shit. I didn't realize that. Hmm. I'm gonna be crossing the street. I gotta stop somewhere anyway. Uh, I gotta go get some Walmart bags. You know. <sighs> Just kidding. This is a wealthy area. Very nice down here. I'll tell you. Yep. Grand Theft Auto style, right? <laughs> Walking through a gas station. Wow, this is nice. You got old pumps in here and all this shit. Look at that shit. Gasoline, old pumps. Um, Lake Oswego is a nice town, but someone still drives an old car like that every now and then, you know? I have an old truck, too. Nice place to get exercise. Exercise. Especially when, when the weather's right. This the area is heavy. This is how I got attracted to Portland. When it was nice out in the summertime, like every fucking day was like warm enough where you could walk. And you felt that nice air, that northwest air. It was nice. It drew me in, kind of. It made me want to come out here, you know? Not gonna lie, and I'm kind of getting reminders of that now. With the weather getting nicer and shit. Range Rover. Range Rovers are typically cars that that uh, women drive. I don't think there's many men that drive Range Rovers. I don't think there are. Truthfully. TikTok cleaners. Now, walking along here. Well, the main road. This is away from the downtown, but there's a store I want to go to up here. So I could possibly avoid driving down here later. I would much rather walk. I would much rather walk. The bees are going to drive down here later, you know. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop right over here. The liquor store and the wine store. Alright, talk to y'all later, I'm shutting it down. There you go, Oregon. Sitting here watching the traffic. I got two mile parking, so I'm going to keep an eye on my truck as well. I'm at Firehouse Pub right here. Sitting down because I got to smoke. I just lit up right here outside. Sunshine weather. I haven't had a day like this in a while, so I'm fucking breaking out, you know, terribly, you know, overcast and all that shit. So, I'm Sunday, then while I'm smoking, too, you know. So, in that case, just chilling out here. Outside in downtown Lake Oswego. One of the most wealthy towns in the area. Sitting down. Down the street.
street, that's where I was walking over there. Nice day, I might as well take advantage of it. Well, in that case, I'm gonna go right now. Talk to y'all later. Took my shirt off right out here in public. Right all over here. Um, so I'm just sitting here. The sun is that great and it's warm enough. Holy fuck. I didn't think it was going to be this warm today. I could take my freaking shirt off like it's Florida here in the Northwest. What the fuck is going on with the weather patterns lately, huh? Jeez. Look at that. That's fucking good. Sitting here chilling. All the bees, some flies are coming around me now. It's like kind of fucking ridiculous. But that might when I need a drink. Yeah. Don't ask me if I want to or anything. I didn't think I'd be able to do this. Wow. So, this is my video. I guess I'm going to cover just this area. I don't know yet. Stuff. Sitting out here, being able to sit out here like this. Did a bike bike rider up there. Chilling here, just enjoying it for how it is. Everybody is all that kind of stuff. I had no idea it was going to be this warm today. Tell you. So, that being said, I'm going to shut it off again, just checking back. Do I want me to buy a drink? So, I'll probably buy a drink or something. I don't know. If I could continue to sit here anyway. So, they kind of get me into the kind of asking, you know. So, alright, guys, talk to you later. Okay, I'm going to head back. Shirt on in the Pacific Northwest today. Nice sun. We got Chico's across the street. If I didn't already show that. Thing is, here trying to juggle all this because I got I got my shirt on my shoulder here. Uh, so, you know, very beautiful. I didn't think it was going to be this fucking nice. Huh? I'll tell you that. I didn't think so. But coming back up over here now. I got a two hour time limit, so I'm gonna fucking make that two hour time limit up here. So, anyway. Come on. Here it is. Didn't get any on me. So, today I'm sporting my red pants with one of my belts right there and my turquoise sneakers going down the boulevard like in the old days you know like anyone you could ever think of you know like uh, hey so there it is really um,
go across the street here a little bit. Gonna cross the street. Ah, uh, Lake Oswego, right there, my friend. Lake Oswego. Coming back around. Physical therapy. So yeah, I think I'm gonna get ready to go. Just about. Talk to you later. The great mountain John would be making videos again. Or get motivated in some way to do this. I thought I retired. I really did. But I guess I didn't. here on the streets. So yeah, it's still going. All right, folks. Uh, I think I better wrap it up almost. Just wanted to check back in. I'm kind of walking over the same streets over and over and over and over again. So, So yeah, I think that'll be all for now, folks. In case I make a video again, we'll see. I don't know.